hey guys welcome back to my channel this is hd signature so on today's tutorial guys like you can already tell from the title i'm going to be teaching you guys how to add an outline to your image on pixart so if you don't already have a pixart app i would advise you guys to go over to your app store or your play store to download that and come along with me so after downloading your pixart you want to go into the app itself pixart guys on it then it brings you to this um, background and you want to click on this plus sign in the bottom side of your screen after clicking on that it's going to take you to different different templates for whatever it is you want to create so let's say i'm going to be creating um a youtube um thumbnail so i'm going to be going to outlets and i'll go through uh, the templates i'll be going through youtube and i'll pick one of these uh, images one of these templates i'll click on it and delete totally so after deleting that guys i'm just going to be adding a background to that i want to pick red. i've already added um, the background i wanted so what i'm going to be doing next is to go into add image so after going into add image i'm just going to look for a picture that i would like to use and um, i'm going to be picking the picture that i will like to use so i'll be picking this very one here i will add it to the screen so now guys in order for me to because this picture that i use as a background so i'm just going to quickly take off the background i'll be going into cut out then I'll, it's already on the uh, icon that I'm using, cutting it out. So I'm just going to go ahead and use that to like pick out what I want, the part that I want. So basically, this cutout is just going to pick my image without the background. So I'll click on this image icon here just to extract just my image from that, and I'll click on save. So after clicking on save, you see, you see, guys, it's just going to bring out just my image without the background so now the the fun part of this tutorial is where you add the um what's it called the outline but before that i just want to quickly make this um this icon bright a bit to make it bright a bit so i'm going to be going into adjust from the adjust uh the amount of brightness um, i want it darker or a little bit brighter you know guys so I'm going to go into contrast. The contrast is to make it look a bit vibrant and I'll click on apply. So I'm done with that and I'll be going into the border guys. In this lower part I'm flipping through. You can see guys from, opac from opacity to blend to effect to adjust to flip slash rotate. The last one is the border. So I'm going to be clicking on the border guys and see what magic it's going to do to this image. Ta-da! So guys, this amount here is just going to be how i mean large you want the border to be how small or how medium size you want it so let's say i want it this way and this lower part of it here are the colors in which you want to put the borders in sorry the outline is which is if you want this color it will change it to that color if you want yellow if you want um pink or you want white any color guys is just going to give you that or any color you want so basically guys i'm just going to pick white from this one after picking white, i'll go to the upper side where you have nest the icon before the nest i'll click on it and i'll click on duplicate twice so i can bring out these images like this is also if you want to clone yourself guys so i'll click on this image i'll go back to that same icon close to nest and i click on to the back click on this one to the back so i can have like them being at the back of the image at the front so if i want guys i sorry if i want i will change the colors the front part i can change the color into um you know I'll click on the border again i can change the color to pink blue you know just to make it attractive the one at the back i can change the color into i can change the color into like lemon or yellow and this one at the back here i can change the color you know you have to when you click on an image here you have to click on a, the border so the colors comes out so on this part i can i'll click on what color do i want here let me see something flashy let me see yellow 
or this color no that is just going to um this this front part let's let's make it white guys so i'll click on that to just make it white this very one i can make that one black can you see guys so i mean this is just basically what you need to do and i'm just going to go to the text and add how to how to to add outline to your image on pics at check then can you see that this image this text is actually covering the images like you you might not really see because it's overpowering it so i'll go to stroke so that the, the text can stand on it so why you still why you also still see what is behind this i'll click on the colors that i want here so i'm going to on the text i want it to be black uh sorry on the text on the text i want it to be um on the stroke i want it to be white no i want the text to be no type i want the i want the text to be black and i want the color to be white yeah this is what i wanted so i'm going to reduce that i'm going to expand it so it looks really nice so this is it guys this is how it looks so let me know what you guys think about this i mean with this a very easy quick um, tutorial you guys can do anything with that um, outline because i just decided to show you guys so after you're done with this you want to click on um, next you click on next again you click you close this you click on save click on save again and voila it saves to your photos and you click on done so you click on done then you want to go to your images you will see it there guys can you see it's as bold see can you see the way it's looking so so thank you so much guys for watching if you do enjoy this tutorial if i actually explained this tutorial to you guys in a nutshell please don't forget to comment that below don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed before and thank you so much guys if you enjoyed this tutorial bye